out loud. LOL, would you say no? Wait a minute. God is not mocked, Galatians 6, 7. God is not mocked. Whatever a man or woman sows, we sow in action and in word, don't we? You will reap. Guaranteed by the Lord. Hey? Eh? So, the missing part is that that believing that whoever believes in Him, Him, God gave His only begotten Son, whoever believes in Jesus, well, you can forget the Muslims, and they don't believe in Jesus. Whoever believes in Jesus, it's all about Jesus, isn't it? Believing in Jesus. The just will live by faith in the Son of God. If we're going to be justified, it has to be by faith. Obedience in the Son of God. Right? This is where all the confusion sets in among religious organisations. Believe, what does it mean? Believe means to do. Believe means to do. It means to do what Jesus said. You say, well, you're a bit of a hard line, huh? You can't expect everyone to do everything that Jesus said. I mean, only Jesus, you know, can do that. We have the same spirit that raised Jesus from the dead. The Holy Spirit. And if you believe, Scripture says, we can do all things through Christ who strengthens, gives us the strength to do it. Is that right? Someone say amen. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, we can't do it. I'm trying my best. Well, if you can try your best to please God, Jesus can have to come in and terra firma. If you can try your best and enter the kingdom of heaven, well, once again, you don't believe and you mock God because God says you can't enter the kingdom without Jesus. God says you need Jesus. I need thee every hour, most gracious Lord. No tender love like thine does peace afford. Oh, I need thee. Oh, I need thee, every hour I need thee, oh, bless me now, my Savior, I come to thee. So Acts 6, 4, the theme of Jesus Christ's ministry is mission, that our mission is the word. Jesus the Christ ministry is mission. It's his mission we're on. Not Jesus is, is not on my mission and in my mission. I'm on his mission and in his mission. And his mission was the plan of salvation. To save you from you. Save you from sin, me. Save me from me. My worst enemy is me, not the devil. Because it's me that says yes to the devil or no to the devil. It was Eve that said yes to the devil. The devil didn't say yes to the devil. It was Eve. Believing. When we really believe, right? Out of these four parts in John 3.16, four headlines, Father, Father loves us, he, he, number two, he gave an offering, his only son. It had to be a sure offering. It had to be once and for all offering. No more repeats. Like the priests of the Old Testament. Repeat offerings. Repeat, repeat. But now once and for all, one offering for all peoples and salvation for all peoples on faith obedience only. 
Number three, fathers desire that not one perish, but that all repent and turn. And then the requirements, father has condition. Unless you love me more than your mother, sister, brother, unless you love me more than your possessions and professions. Now some people love their job more than Jesus. They just love it. Because in that job, they're praised, they're worshipped, they're, they've got this uh, self-achievement, self, self, self-achievement and self-confidence and self-accomplishment. Sister, there's nothing wrong with having uh, that witness of self accomplishment and self-achievement as long as as we keep that reigned under the verse that says without him we can do nothing that we can't smile have a belly laugh or a nice meal we can't taste we have no taste buds without Jesus, the Creator. We have no sight. That's why blind Bartimaeus went to Jesus. So he could see. Because he wanted